All right, guys, let's continue here. We got a new log. What is this one? Oh, he's going to talk about Shepard. A big topic. That's right. They just they lie and exaggerate. All conspiracies. They don't know the whole story. That's right. Men that look like that are the rarest, let me tell you. That guy right there. Anyway. <laughs> Men who could just break mirrors by simply glancing at them? Oh, man. One in a million. There's nothing in the... No logs in the bathroom? He didn't leave a log there in the bathroom. He did leave a log here next to his bed. That is a marvelously large closet. Wow. That's about ten times bigger than my closet in real life. All right, new questions. These are all questions for his biography. Okay. I, have your new I don't have, hold on. Mateo the God, I don't have a favorite food. I don't have a food that if I ever could just keep eating it and not get tired of it, I would get tired of any food. I like things in moderation and I like things when I don't have something for a while then I crave it. I don't have a favorite food or anything like that. As a okay. Leader, do I ever feel what happened? There's no subtitles now. There it is. But I think I know what you're after. You're referring to the way I um, arranged to have the Normandy released to Commander Shepard before the Battle of the Citadel. I'm not sure how valuable hindsight is to the military. Obviously, it worked out for the best. Without the Normandy and Commander Shepard free to do what they needed to do, what we needed them to do, Saren might have taken the Citadel. I think it's clear what a different galaxy this would be if that had happened. I did what I had to. If I had been wrong, I would have gladly accepted the repercussions. The real trick is never being wrong. <laughs> if you're looking for more action and less philosophy in these notes, let me know. So he's got a big biography written about him. And he's answering all these questions. Massive stakes of would I go to Jersey Mike's again? Yes, why wouldn't I? Jersey Mike's is great food. I like Jersey Mike's. Certain things are quite good. The fresh, the fresh chicken cheese steaks are really, really good. Uh, so Blue says that everything of making tips goals more game related or interactive. I mean, yeah, but we would have to think of specific things for each game. I don't know what you guys would want. I ask you guys all the time for feedback, and I try to do what you guys want, you know? Um, there's only so much I can try to do for myself or figure out for myself, especially because I'm limited in what I can do, you know? Uh, if you have, I, see, it's easy for you to ask that question, but then the, the, the follow up question that I give to you is the, what, what would you like? Like, right now we're playing Mass Effect. What would you like as a tips goal for Mass Effect? If we hit fifty dollars in the stream tonight, what would you like me to see see me do or, or happen? Because we're playing Mass Effect. Give me an idea, and we'll talk about it. Okay, sushi or dumplings? Uh, again, I like both. Depends. The Normandy SR one. I really don't want to listen to this. I'm getting tired of the logs. I'll be honest. I want action now. I'm kind of tired of his logs. The Turian experience. All right, I'm not reading these. Childhood. Who cares about that? <laughs> How many beds does he have in his house? It's like 10 beds, 12 beds. Oh my god, he's got a full-size bubbling hot tub. Wow. Jump right in. I would jump the fuck in. Ladies and gentlemen, a mirror that works. I can't believe it. We found a video game with a working mirror. This must be like the one of the two possible. Because most games never have working mirrors. That's pretty impressive. Nice rock. To me, five dollars that I've been enjoying the Mass Effect streams. It's a shame it seems to lost support. Yeah, it seems to me that the, here's here's what happened. All right, for those who are watching on YouTube and don't know, the amount of attendance we've gotten and the amount of support we've gotten around the Mass Effect streams has dwindled greatly. You want to know why? I can tell you why. Because this came out as a trilogy, 
And my audience likes watching one game at a time. My audience doesn't like watching part one, part two, part three all in a row. Like, that is too much. It becomes overload. This has happened every time I've done it over the years. There was one year where there was like three Mario games within six months. And, of course, by the time I played the third one, most people were, were burned out on Mario. Um, I get it. I knew when this trilogy came out, this was probably going to happen. I knew there'd probably be more hype around the first game, me replaying it, because I hadn't replayed it in so long. And it's my favorite in the trilogy. But I knew that when I kept going, it was going to dwindle and dwindle and dwindle. And there was nothing I could do because I wanted to play it more. And people kept telling me, no, don't play it as much. Do, do this instead. Do this instead. Do this instead. So I listened to my audience, you know. And then we end up playing this game. You know, we played Mass Effect 1 for like two, three weeks. This we've been playing for over a month because we're only playing it a couple times a week because people don't want to see it that much anymore, you see? Um, so I totally get it. But we're so far in, we're near the end. Like, we're about almost 30 hours in now. And all we got to do is this DLC and then the finale and we're done. So that's what I mean. Like, I wish that people would just be patient because sadly what happens is people come by and they come, oh, I don't want to see this. Or, oh, I'm still playing this. Like, dude, we're so close to the end. Seriously, like, this is... We're literally in the home stretch right now. This is the final little bit of, of kind of cool story you're going to get. And then after this, we get... Um, after this, we get the finale, you know? We're done. Another week or two, I'm done with this game for sure. But that's why I keep saying when people are like, Oh, you're going to play this game, this game? Well, if I play all those games, I'll never finish this one. <laughs> you know? You have a good night, Mateo. Okay. So now we're heading into other places in the Citadel where we have interactions with all of the different crew members, if I remember correctly. Look at this. What brand laptop did I get? Acer. It's an Acer Aspire 5. TDS, you have a good night as well. So, my bubble is enjoying the Mass Effect streams. I'm glad to hear that. <clears throat> to Shepard doesn't have to wait. He skips the fucking line. And you all like it, bitches. <laughs> That's right. I'm hot shit. Ah, Commander Shepard. <clears throat> Your table is ready. Him and Joker are going to have some sushi. Where is he? Wait, uh, where the fuck is he? I knew about this place before it was cool. Oh, uh, shut up. Way in the back. This is a pretty crazy sushi bar. Look at all those fish swimming in the sides and everything. That's pretty neat. Hey, Shepard. Not bad, huh? Sushi place is serious. Like, French guy at the door serious. Only had to save the galaxy twice to get a table here. You see the line outside? The. <laughs> ha ha! He's like, no, fuck you. Stay in line. But here I am, drink in hand. Best pilot in the universe and a rock star. <laughs> Any news from the Normandy? Oh, uh, you know, maintenance stuff. It's hard knowing a bunch of strangers are poking around in my ship. I, I mean, your ship. All right. Snorlax says, you can now preload Pokemon Unite, the free Pokemon mobile coming out Wednesday. Are you checking it out? I literally just got done saying I can't play every other game until I finish these other games that I'm playing. I literally just finished saying that. <laughs> Alright, let me summarize uh, as quickly as I can. No, I'm not playing that game. I don't have time for it. Okay. <clears throat> hey, Derek, good evening. It's good to see you. Some of my favorite wrestling things of all time would probably be the original DX theme and Cult of Personality. Big Beach says to see you tomorrow. Alright, Big Beach, you have a good night. Thank you. And then we got a troll who's just going to get his ass kicked right out really quickly. Fucking wasting everyone's time. Good night. Good night, sweet prince. Okay. <clears throat> Let someone else do the work for once. Hackett's orders. You're on shore leave. Yeah, whether we like it or not, I'm sure you'll manage. <laughs> I may need a drink that comes with an umbrella. I'm the first human inspector. I'll get you two umbrellas. Awesome use of power, boss. <laughs> so, your email said it was important? My email. I'm here because I got a message from you. Oh, shit. Well, I didn't send anything. They got set up. 
Commander! Excuse me, sorry. Lion's business. Commander, this is urgent! I don't think that's the umbrella lady. <laughs> Commander Shepard, I'm Staff Analyst Maya Brooks. Alliance, excuse me. Alliance Intelligence. There are people trying to kill you. <laughs> yeah, I think he's aware of that. <clears throat> no, I don't mean Cerberus and the Reapers. I mean other people, new people. There, it's... <sighs> Someone is hacking your account. Com channels, personal records. They're targeting you specifically. Ah, targeting me. What do they want? The intel isn't definitive yet. Last time, I guess without definitive intel, we almost landed troops on a gas giant, which is bad. Hang on, Brooks. Take a breath. <sighs> From the top, what do you know? Excuse me, you don't have a reservation. They're coming in with guns. Stop! Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight's performance is brought to you by random acts of violence. Jesus. Man, well, I have C set come help. <laughs> Stay there. I'm coming. Joker? Ow, my pancreas. <laughs> hey! Damn it. Got one, sir. Find the crew. I'm going after her. Find the crew. Got it. Now I got a gun. Thanks, asshole. You used me as bait? Go. You used me as bait? <laughs> he said it again. <laughs> they all have the exact same side roll enemy. Hang on. Shot of my ass. Commander. What the fuck is going on? There's another guy I appeared out of thin air behind me. Where now? I don't know where anyone is. I can't tell. There's another guy over there. Oh my god. Commander. I have no ammo. What am I supposed to do? Oh my god. Well then. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh shit. Brooks. Whoa. This is like an action movie. Shit. It's literally like an action movie. <laughs> Shepard is out for blood. Jackie Chan called. He wants his stunts back, huh? Wow. Secure terminal. Are you okay down there? Uh, yep. Feeling good. Brooks, you got hit. I know. I used Medigel. A lot of it. Um, all of it, actually. I know everything is a little bit bouncy. I think you used too much. <laughs>
Guys, I don't care if the current temperature of units don't work. Get it done, Citadel oh, Air. <laughs> I'll look for a way Citadel out. Air. This is the, you know what this reminds me of? The fifth I element. Sky cars across the That's what this part of the game is like. The Maybe fifth the element. I'm checking the area. Transportation no. Yeah. No. Laundry. Ah, oh, it's a sky car lot. Cision motors. Get a shuttle over there. I'll find a way across. Okay, right. Warning. Okay. So, um, it turns out CSEC has the whole area locked down. It's gonna be a tiny bit tricky to get you a shuttle. Keep at it, Brooks. What the hell is this? Oh. Fish. How they found you. Who are these guys? Right? I don't know. Yeah. They really don't seem to like you. Yeah, I'm sensing that. Why would there be now wait a minute? Why would there be a refrigerator or a refrigerated unit full of fish with a hole in the fucking wall that goes out to the street? Wait a minute. Wouldn't that completely negate the purpose of the refrigeration? What the hell? Uh, what the fuck? He's just standing here in the fucking fridge with the fish. What is what is going on? Huh? <laughs> Nothing that's happening right now is making any sense. What? What on earth? Derek, I would choose no more words. There you go. It's future check. It's too primitive to understand. We're too primitive to understand it. Uh, I'm pretty sure that the laws of, you know, heating and cooling won't change in the future. They really want this to be like fucking, like, like, uh, Splinter Cell or some shit. That hurt him. The crew is headed your way. Good to hear. Things are a little dicey. I will attempt to register. Surprise. I have three bullets. Pistol power magnifier. They're still finding upgrades even in this. Oh my god. You can still find upgrades in this DLC. Even though this came out, and literally this came out a year after. This game was already ending. They still had things in the DLC. <laughs> That's funny. Like, the vast majority of people who played this had already beaten the main game, and there's no way that they were going to get uh, use out of these upgrades and things. I know you're licking the fruit when I'm not around. Stop that, seriously. Stop it, you jerk. Brooks, found a way across. It's locked down. This is a cell phone store. Right, yeah, it is. Look, it's like basically it's like a cell phone store. Uh, can you get through? D I'll a data pad it. store. Uh. Oh. Skycar lock. I leveled up. Get to the car lot across the way. Oh shit. Oh boy. I better run. It's all under control. Darling, here's the deal. You can't say stuff like that to Giala. She'll freak out. 
Her blue head will pop right off. <laughs> what the fuck am I reading? What am I? <laughs> Her blue head will pop right off. Get this shit out of my face. What is going on in this game? Good. What do we know about these mercenaries? They have guns that don't like me. That's not helpful. Commander, it would really be great if you could <laughs> double spank. <laughs> hey, they called me. All staff, so we're considering leaving my employee for working at Hussies over at Micah. I definitely should be reading this stuff in the middle of me trying to survive. Here come a ton more. Yeah, see ultralight materials? Look, there's upgrade shit everywhere. What the fuck? I was supposed to do there. I have fucking no ammo at all. Now I have 32 bullets at least. Amazing. <laughs> what gameplay? There's a C-Sec shuttle inbound if you can get to the Sky Car lot. Understood. This is very ridiculous for a DLC. It plays nothing like... It seriously is playing nothing like the rest of the game. But, I mean, that's on purpose. I think they want to do something very different for a post-game DLC. Nothing here? What's the point of that even being there? Anyway. Okay. Where's Keanu Reeves? I know he should be here with me. Having a bad day, Shepard. <laughs> you could say that. Landing pad is over there, but it's behind a locked gate. Let's look for a control panel. I like your outfit. Mm. A control panel, right. I think this outfit was specific for this DLC. Tank. Like I've been okay. I've been wearing that outfit in the main game, but that outfit was supposed to be specific for this DLC and was added into the game later. You couldn't wear that outfit until this DLC had been released, but I've been wearing it in the main game. Simple Bubble says, I find the silly dialogue and solid gameplay of the game the attention grabber. This will be silly, but this this whole DLC is silly. You're gonna see. It's got some serious stuff to it, it's got funny stuff to it. I quite love so by the way, guys, FYI, about 30 to 40 minutes left on tonight's stream. Again, guys, please, if you can help me tonight with support, I would appreciate it. It's been incredibly we'll slow. About it and I really need help with tips to pay my taxes tomorrow. So if you could tip me tonight, please do. And I appreciate any contributions that come in. Thank you. All right. Let's continue. Where the fuck? Locate the gate controls. Right here. This gun stinks. Stand back. One moment. Hello. Could you please open the gate? Oh, uh, something weird just happened. What the fuck just happened? Okay, there we go. The chat resized somehow and it was screwed Thank up and I fixed it. That looked weird. Please leave. Tavolis. Well, I could have done that. To the extraction zone. See, now we're good because now Liara and I will just do our combo fucking move. You know, singularity and flare. It just kill everything. This is get to the extraction zone. There's no fucking waypoints. How am I supposed to know which way to go? This way? I. Oh. I found ultralight materials. 
This doesn't even... <coughs> what the fuck? It looks like a door. It's not. Used sky car? Examine all these used sky cars. Oh, I see. They're really trying to... It's a car dealership. I get it. <coughs> it's a freaking car dealership. Okay. This DLC feels like Cyberpunk. This was Cyberpunk before Cyberpunk. They tried to make it feel like I said, like the 50 elements and shit. That's what this is like. Oh, God. Now, what the fuck? Now it's not working at all. My chat is not working. Yeah, look at that. It's completely resized and screwed up. What the fuck? Yeah, my chat is completely screwed up right now. I'm gonna have to redo the chat. The chat glitched on this laptop now. First time it's, you know, I'm using the laptop. It glitched and I have to redo it. Hold on. Rex? What are you doing here? There we go. Uh, just oh, Rex! What the hell? Broken expansion. Rex showed up. That's cool. All right, I just fixed it. Now the chat's working again. Stupid thing had. I guess there's some glitches with modern uh, mass. Wait, I was say matter mass effect with modern Windows, here, where the the browser window oh, screwed yeah. up and it was like no, not no. moving properly, so I had to redo it. And now it's working. Commander, Joker, we lost our ride. Where are you? On my way. Picked up Brooks. Figured you'd have a few questions. Good call. Are we extraction? Is it me or is the handgun way better than this guy? Commander, did C Sec find you? Are you okay? Yes and no. Merck's in the C Sec shuttle. What? A little busy right now. Right, sorry. We'll be there soon. Rex, what the fuck? What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Almost there, Commander. Hang on. Rex is like insisting to get in the line of fire. Great place to fight it. Lots to destroy. <laughs> he literally walked in front of every bullet that I used. Approaching your position, Commander. Wow. Just following the gunfire. Copy that. Sorry I'm late. Had to take the scenic route. Scenic route? We nearly crashed four times. Where the hell did you... Did you learn to drive? Look. Jim Brooks says hi. There we go. That's my favorite combo right there. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite biotic combo on the Citadel. <laughs> Good to go, Commander. Here we go. You can't roll away from Singularity. What are you, stupid? You're out of your mind. Where's the extraction zone exactly here? Oh, I guess that was it. Okay. There it was eight years ago I played this. 2013, so actually eight and a half years ago. Yeah. Gabe, this the this laptop is hooked up with Ethernet. I'm not using the wireless. I only used the wireless at first to get it set up, and then when I when I got it all working, I plugged in the Ethernet cord, so. I don't use wireless with nothing. All my consoles are plugged Someone in, this is plugged in, and my desktop's plugged in. Who were those mercenaries? They were heavily armed and using C-Sec shuttles. I don't know. I've never seen them before. I can't believe you survived all that. They had guns. And grenades. And those drone things. Mario Mario just took me $4.20. Thank you, Mario Mario, for the tip. I appreciate that. He says, how am I doing tonight? I'm doing good. I'm enjoying this DLC. I am. It's interesting and very different from the rest of the game. That's for sure. Let me know if you see your brother Luigi Mario around. Tell him what's up. What's up. <laughs> Darius says, how's the new laptop? What happened to the old laptop? It's right here. I didn't even put it. I'm going to put it in the closet tonight. And, you know, for now, I'll leave it in there. I'm going to see what I want to do with it. I don't know. Likely, I could trade it in and make some money. Because it, technically, it does work. It just runs like complete shit. 
and I'm sure someone might be able to completely reformat it if they wanted to. So I might trade it in somewhere, try to get credit or something. I don't know. I got to see what I want to do with it. But it's going in the closet as of tonight. And the new laptop looks good. Like, it looks smooth. I had a little issue. What happened was, so I clicked on the, st on the stream chat here. And the window, like, changed size by itself. And I don't know why, because I didn't tell it to resize it or anything. And then all, all of a sudden, I couldn't, it wouldn't scroll. I couldn't click on anyone's name. It was screwed up. So I closed it, reloaded it, and now it works fine. The thing is, now this laptop's so good, I could close it, reload it like that. The other laptop, I'm not kidding. I'd close it, go to reload it. It would take like five minutes. That's how bad the other laptop was. Okay, so what happened to CSEC? It's all right. I'm calling Commander Bailey. See what's going on with CSEC. Okay, that sounds... Wait! Wouldn't that just make whoever you contact a target too? She's right, Shepard. Until we know more, it's a huge risk. Okay. Huh. For now, we run this ourselves. Right. Ourselves. On our own. Outside the law. Okay. Yeah. She's hyper. <laughs> Brooks, it's okay. I know this is a lot to deal with. I got shot. I got medigel, but still, I took a desk job explicitly to not get shot. And you killed a hundred guys with a pistol. Well, yes, that did happen. I mean, who does that? <laughs> well, you, I guess. But besides you, they said the medigel might make me jumpy. Do I seem jumpy? How did you get mixed up in this? I monitored data for Alliance Intel to prevent fraud and hacking of officer IDs. Like, uh, someone using an Admiral's pass to get into a nightclub on the Citadel when that Admiral is fighting on Tichanka. I wrote a tracking program. It's really neat. I named it Mr. Biscuits, after my cat. Oh my god. Right, sorry. Anyway, Mr. Bis- uh, My program detected a breach in your classified files. Soon, everything we had on you was compromised. Personnel files, mission reports, everything. Since when does hacking personnel records involve heavy weapon fire? Think of what criminals could do if they had Shepard's military access codes. Or Spectre codes, even. Explains why they need you dead, Shepard. Nothing to stop them till the damage is done. Huh. Uh, okay. Well, shore leave canceled again. Guess we're back on the clock. <laughs> Looks that way. Those mercenaries aren't wasting any time. Okay. Ideas on where to start with these guys? Maybe. That pistol you picked up. For such a tiny thing, it packs a punch. Never seen anything like it before. Nor have I. Let me see if I can dig something up. Well, you can try. But I should warn you, I haven't found anything yet, and I've been digging pretty deep. I'm sure you have. Glyph. Collating relevant intel for review, Dr. Tassoni. Thanks. All right, the hour's on point. What about the rest of the crew? Yeah, what about those slackers? <laughs> Joker, you've been busy. I found some folks who actually like being shot at. Permission to come aboard, Shepard? They're all here to help. <laughs> Speak to your squad mates. Cool. Okay. Where is everybody? Joker. I can't... <laughs> the, 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 it's weird. There. Okay. Later, when this is over and everything is settled, we are going to talk about this bait thing. No, that's right, when you made him bait. Tali. Back during my pilgrimage, I used to walk around near that sushi place and watch the fish through the window. I knew they'd never let me inside. To... I think to myself, someday, when I've proven my worth to the galaxy, I'll go there for dinner. And then... You broke their food. <laughs> Do they even have food you can eat there? Not the point, Shepard. Uh, well, oh well. Save you some money anyway. It's probably overpriced. The Normandy's nice, but for unwinding after a mission, you can't get better than this. Observation lounge needs a hot tub. Ah, stuck. <laughs> Joe Biden has sent me $10. Says, you're the man now, Phil. Keep, keep, keep up the good work. Sounds good, Joe Biden. You're totally not a robot or anything. What? We're at $33 to tips. We're only 17 away from the Gunner Glasses, which would be a good start. Even though we've only got about 20 minutes left on the stream, it would certainly be a good start for tonight. Thank you, guys. The restaurant attack has made the news. 
Civilian casualties seem to have been restricted to fish. Hmm. Trying to get Joe Biden up here as the top contributor. We all know Smoke and Joe. Always contributing to my streams. Legit. <clears throat> James! Nothing beats having a Krogan bodyguard, huh? I had a buddy like that once. But, uh, no, not so much a buddy, really. More of a prisoner who helped us. Prisoner? <laughs> it, it's a long story, man. Anyway, Brooke, she's kind of cute. Think she's on the market? <laughs> oh, my God. James. Stop it, James. Simple Bubble says, I'm going to transfer all my data over. I have no data on the Samsung laptop. I told you that Samsung laptop was only used to look at stream chat and look at contributions on streams. That was it. I, there's no data on that to transfer that I, that I use or need. So. I'm glad you made it out of that. Cortez. Okay. None of us saw that coming. But lesson learned. Never have dinner with Joker. It won't end well. Duh. Oh, there's a new communication here. Is there? No, I don't think so. These are all the old emails from the rest of the game, so I don't think there's anything new here. And that's, again, if you want to buy those upgrades to upgrade your apartment. The whole idea is you do this DLC while you're still doing the story of the game, Shepard, and you can use it as a hideout something. for your crew. We can gather the team whenever you're ready. Oh, okay. I'm going to have to write a report about getting shot. I hear those are really complicated. It's faster if you make a template. <laughs> make a template for getting shot, so that way it uh, doesn't take forever. Where's the rest of the crew? Where's Garrus? Where's Rex? Are they upstairs, maybe? Oh, Rex is chilling here. Oh, look. Javik. I didn't even know Javik was here. Commander, in my cycle, when we fled combat by falling through tanks containing aquatic animals, we usually... Oh, right. <laughs> we never did. <laughs> you are a trailblazer. Javik, you're a dickhead. <laughs> you're a complete ass. Shout out to Chocoboko, who just tipped me $11. And he said, not so fast, Mr. President. I remain in the top tip this time, even if we are at the, at the last minute here. Thank you for that. That gets us up to $44 in tips. Thank you, Chocoboko. Appreciate that. Okay. Let's see here. <clears throat> I don't know what you mean, Derek. He says, your goatee and your characters are awesome. Did used to be that. What do you mean? Like that? Like, actually, when I first started growing my goatee out, I used to grow it way down my face, and it was bigger, and, and like, I always grew it longer. But over time, what happens is your hair changes. Like, even right now, like, my, how my hair feels on my face feels different than it did, like, 10 years ago. It used to feel more, feel more wiry and stuff, and now it feels, like, less like that. But, of course, it used to be very dark, and I don't have... I almost have no dark hairs on my face left anymore. They're almost all white. So, I couldn't even have a goatee that looked like that, even if I wanted to. <laughs> I couldn't. <clears throat> Bet you never saw a shuttle get taken down like that before. <laughs> I still got it. Oh, Rex. Bragging as always. So, I don't know where Garrus is. Wait a minute. Is he in the hot tub? No, he's not in the hot tub. That would have been actually cool if he was in the hot tub. He's like, hey, you guys do whatever you want. I'm a little busy. Here he is. So, what was it, Shepard? Five minutes before someone started shooting at you? <laughs> On the other hand, we get this cool secret hideout to hang out in. Unless the bad guys look in the window. All right. Okay. So let's talk to Liara. This should initiate the next I part of the DLC. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to Clay. Here we I've go. I've made some progress. Would you like me to call the meeting? Okay. Oh, let's see. Let, all right, let's talk about Do it. Do it. Yeah, let's see. What does she find? We have a lead. I called in some favors to run a trace on the gun. It led me to a casino owner named Elijah Khan. He's been suspected of using his profits to smuggle weapons onto the Citadel. Immediately after the attempt on Shepard's life, Khan made an interesting call. Oh, yeah? 
I'm cutting you off. I'm returning your down payment now. What's the problem? Turn on a vid screen. When I sell a gun, I don't want it showing up on the nightly news. Huh. You won't be linked to me. Save it. Our association is terminated. And if you even think of coming after me, I've got info on you ready for prime time. So you ponder that. Con out. So that's our identity thief. Looks like he's got an ID disguise on. Those things are a pain in the ass to get around. Hmm. Yeah, so who were all those mercenaries? Did you get anything on the mercenaries who attacked us? They're a private military corporation called Cat-6. As most of you know, Cat-6 is an alliance nickname for dishonorable discharges. Many have criminal records, histories of steroid abuse, and other charming features. No doubt hired by the thief, not by Khan. <laughs> that phone call was pretty damning stuff. How'd you get it? It involved the weapons biometric data, Solarian intelligence, and a Hanar prostitute with camera implants. Uh, Seriously? Too much info! No, but the truth is boring. Oh, <laughs> she made it up. Okay. Khan didn't sound friendly to whoever that voice was. Maybe he'd pass on that info to us. That would take some extremely smooth talking. If he sees you, he'll probably assume you're looking for revenge. The casino has a panic room. Chances are he'll have gone to ground there. Edie can give us programs to hack the door, but the cameras and guards complicate things. Yeah. Khan could disappear. Or worse, if his guards ever open fire, normal people could get hit. Hmm. Like I did. She's right. We can't risk spooking him. We go in quiet. Small team. No gunplay. Dr. Tassoni, this evening the casino will be hosting a charity event to assist war refugees. Purchase some tickets, Glyph. Then call up a layout of the building. Score! So, how close can you get? You don't usually put a back door in a panic room. This air shaft bypasses the security gate and ends up in storage. From there, the panic room's door camera can be disabled. Still, we're talking about a casino. There's gotta be alarms in that shaft. I believe I have it's some casino heist. that may help. I'll Ocean's 13. Who will go in this shaft? They need to be small in size. Yeah, that's not me. Too many snacks of roast bear and leg. I suspect my suit's built-in tech would be picked up by security sensors. Hmm. My presence in the casino would arouse suspicion. Mechs are not allowed, since they can have cheating software. Yeah, but she clog herself. What you need is somebody trained in zero emissions tech. No electronics, no metal, just undetectable polymers. We had a course back at Op End, disabling a bomb with these little tweezers. See, the bomb was filled with shaving cream. All right, you're in. The... What? No. What? You said it yourself. We've all got too much tech. <laughs> but. I managed to get shot just coming to talk to you. Now I'm supposed to hack my way into a safe room. Do you engine? What's his name? Engine and tonic. He started singing "Never Gonna Give You Up" by freaking Rick Astley in a super chat. I, I don't know why. Yeah, engine and tonic TM. Thank you for the super chat. It was uh like five five euros, I believe, or actually five pounds. Thank you for that. Uh, engine. And tonic. Shit. Tonic TM. Thank you for the super chat. Okay. So, yeah, this really is like a heist, a big heist, like a, a casino heist movie at this point now. It's changing. It's no longer like John Wick or Fifth Element. Now it's a casino heist. We'll be backing you up. The second you get something you can't handle, we'll cover you. If that's settled, it looks like there's one last hurdle to get us inside. Which is? Black tie required. So, she's required to be one of your teammates on this mission. Um, she can, uh, Edie cannot come because they'd be bl banned from a casino. That's interesting. No mechs allowed inside of a casino. So, hmm... Who I mean, Caden. If it's black tie affair, Caden would probably look good in the tux. You blend in. I would. I would argue. Um. But Liara's like the. She's the one who who had number one. She's the mastermind of everything. She's so smart. She was the shadow broker, and she has fucking singularity. 
Sing your fucking Larry. Now hold on. Cycle appearances. She has like 10 outfits. Look at all these outfits. Alright, we'll do that. She has so many outfits, it's ridiculous. We changed her appearance at least, so maybe she won't bl she'll blend in or something. I don't know. <laughs> Alright. Guys, we are six dollars away from the first tips reward. Be pretty awesome, just saying. Why Shepard? Formal wear suits you. The if anyone looks at this group tonight, I don't think it's me they'll be lingering on. Well, hopefully you mean her. Ideally, nobody lingers on me at all. Okay. I'll get to the ventilation shaft. Wish me luck. Liara, do you have any input? Khan has a lot of surveillance set up. I'd mingle with the guests if you want to look normal. Okay, Liara. It's time to hobnob with the snobs! Yes! Why, hello, love. Isn't the turnout amazing? I wasn't sure anyone would show up. We pull together when we have to. I feel so bad for the humans. If you need a place to stay or anything, you just let me know. I have a place to stay now, but thanks. So you have Hello, Turtle Dude. Good evening. Good to see you. Oh, how brave of you to endure, dear. The humans are so resilient. Like that phrase of theirs, stiff one in the lips. Stiff upper lip. Stiff upper lip. Right, and shoot from the hip. What did I say? You got a stiff upper lip and shoot from the hip. That's a ACDC song. I used to listen to that when they ju when I just started on YouTube that first year. ACDC came out with a new album, and that was one of their songs. Keeping officer? Sir. That's it? Oh, they are following me around? I didn't even realize. Commander, I'm upstairs by the grate leading to the shaft. But there's uh -oh. a problem. Can you meet me? Already has a problem. Of course. Of course it's already a problem. So push my tour of the camp. So blue, who I vote for is none of your concern and none of your business. Don't ask me political questions on a gameplay stream. It's your problem. Here we are. She can't get in, huh? Okay, right. Just like we thought. There's an alarm on the grate. We'll have to bypass it. Use this. It's a resonance emitter lens. It should let you see security grids and wiring. This is why they took Liara. All of the wiring to a junction <laughs> box. She has a little shit. The alarm. She's yeah. like the M of this operation. She has all the gear. The lens is working. Look at this. What the? Follow the blue wiring. Follow the blue wiring, huh? Said, don't try to bypass a camera while you're being watched. What the fuck? Oh, here he goes. She said, follow the blue wiring. The blue wiring ended. The fuck? So it continued here. Then it split. Oh, God. So, what do I... Oh. Okay. Can I do anything with this? No, but I, I bypassed the security, so I can come back here later if I need to. Follow the blue wiring. I did follow the blue wiring, it ended. The blue wiring ended there. Where the hell did you... Ugh. Follow the blue wiring, it says. <laughs> the blue wiring ends right here. The fuck are you talking about? Oh shit. Okay. No problem. Maybe if you mingle and the casual, don't bypass while you're being watched. Hi, <laughs> I screwed up. I'm running for Zakara Ward. Shepard Mingle. Council. Are you a citizen here? I've had bad experiences with politicians. Who hasn't? That's why I'm running. I got the vent alarm. I tried to, to follow the blue wire in Cerberus or worse. <laughs> oh. The Ugh. board needs refugee facilities. It needs security. It needs jobs. It needs. Oh, excuse me. 
And hopefully, with a friend like Elijah Khan backing me, I can make it happen. No. Oh. Really? Ah. Oh. Good. Follow the blue wiring. No, seriously. Have you? I'll call you back. Potential client here. Enjoying the party? Like adrenaline in my heart. They're gonna have a fire breather on the bar later and shoot fireworks above. Or play the Quasar. Would fireworks even? Remember that from uh, Mass Effect One? It worked at New Year's. Whatever they did, it looked freaking nuclear. No. <laughs> I don't know. She said follow the blue wire. I did and it ended and there's no other blue wire anywhere. Anywhere that I'm looking. Now I'm watched. Now I'm clear. Now I'm watched. Roulette table. I heard your advice okay, here's blue. See? So what's gonna happen but this also ended. Disappointment. What the fuck? This. Wait, maybe. It... Okay. Oh. I see a junction in the wall, but there's a camera watching it. Shepard, I'm sending a hack to your Omni tool. It will fool the camera, but it'll self-delete after a few seconds. Got I passed that camera. Here we go. This place is in. Good. I've got the great open. This place is in. Mingle again. It's time to dance. It's time to do the shepherd dance. The shepherd dance. I say, oh, 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 you know this is so cool. Oh, I practiced all those times until you think you can dance. Do, 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 do. You wish you could dance like Shepard, don't you? I wish. I wish I could dance like fucking Shepard, right? Yeah. Am I skilled at claw games? I used to do decent at claw games. The thing is, Modern claw games are completely rigged. Modern claw games, like one out of every hundred games, the claw will actually have a grip. And then other games it doesn't. I used to actually go to an arcade where the claw game was fair. It was legit fair. And if you had skill, you could win every time. And I used to win all the time. What do you have? Nothing too crazy. I want to be able to walk a straight line. The Testing tempo coming out. Are Asari drinks usually mild? Not all of them. Mr. Khan had us put out some gelatin shots earlier. Also, sorry, they kick like a shotgun. <laughs> okay. Are we good now? I think we're good. We don't have to mingle anymore. No, still mingle more. Oh, mingle even more. Who the fuck is this? Jonah Ashley. Enjoying the party? Young people party. I drink. Tonight it's ring call on the rock. That stuff can put you down for the count. <laughs> I just lost a staggering amount of income. Oh, this puts things in perspective. Ouch! Bad luck. You need a few credits for a ride home or anything? Oh no, it's not like that. You know about all those helium three facilities that are getting wiped out? I've flown by a few. Well, to put it in layman's terms, most of those facilities were mine. That sucks. So you're screwed. They still want me to mingle more. The mingling never ends. Commander. Oh. What? There's a guard right below me. Oh, shit. Don't panic. I'll get his attention. Hey, asshole. Excuse me. I think I saw someone doing drugs in the men's room. I see. Were you able to identify the substance used? <laughs> Red sand. Dispatch, we've got a sand tripper in the bathrooms. Have they tried to compromise the games bionically? Unknown at this time. Moving to confront. Send backup. We're taking care of it, sir. Appreciate the help. You have a good night now. You're clear, Brooks. All right. Thanks, Commander. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. And I'll get back to blending in. Slow and steady. We'll get to Khan. So, to sum up, tomorrow starts with the Help a Dream Foundation, then Help a dream. Blood Drive, Refugee Camp, and Hospital Tour. Hmm. Sounds like you turn pro. I try. Ms. Rios believes we have an obligation to the less fortunate. Of course. So how are you liking the party so far? There's a party? 
There's a party? <laughs> Where are we? Who am I? Ugh, more mingling. Come on, Tiger Bite! Bring it home! You got a lot riding on him? He's my boy. Picked him up at a shelter. Whoever oh. let him go had no eye for racers. He can outrun anything he can't outfight, and outfight anything he can't outrun. Very awesome. races, huh? Enough to pay for my kid's tuition. Hmm. Okay. Go dancing upstairs? I already did. I already danced. Shepard likes to dance the night away. You didn't know? I already talked to her, didn't I? Didn't I? Yeah. Over here, there's mingle shit. Um, oh, talk to me, Brooks. I've got a pressure pad and an obstruction detector ahead. I can't disable them from here. Okay, Edie, I need a tech solution. Brooks, stay put. We'll find some junctions and take down the sensors. Okay. Disable the pair of sensors. Follow Where the are red they? Wiring. doing the game hasn't explained where the sensors are round and round and round I don't get it and there's no waypoint why is there no fucking waypoint right now why did they, they, they get rid of my waypoint uh this is dumb this is seriously stupid that they did it this way why did they disable waypoint so you don't know where to go to do this Follow the red wiring. She said, follow the red wiring. Okay. I guess I was supposed to hear that before. Here it is. This is what we were doing earlier. This is what I was doing, Manager, remember? There's a camera and a guard. I'll just be here. Try not to cough. Okay. Brooks, try it now. Check there you go. Pad. No alarms. Looks good. Just let me know when that other sensor is down. Following the other red wire goes way Follow over the here. Red wiring. Yes, I heard you. Not there. There's a junction by the roulette. Right here. It's in plain view. Suspected? Why? A guard spot. No one was looking at me. Hopefully he'll move on. Absolutely no one was looking at me. It says suspected. Every minute is more Great. exciting than the next. This is a uh, nine year old Should DLC. Someone just asked how old it is. Oh, are you like one of those DLCs? Dude, there's no one here. What the fuck are you talking about? There's no guards there. You, tough guy? Perfect. I need an opinion on something from a B-lister or... I can distract him. Tell me when. I saw a pickpocket working okay. the crowd upstairs. Just a second, ma'am. I'll contact the surveillance. Suspicious what the fuck? What? There's another guy. If you act normal, hopefully he'll move on. Oh my god, I gotta distract Can't this other away, guy. Can you? What can I say? The graphics are great for that old. Yes, you have to remember this is the this is the oh, legendary no edition. Kidding. So this I'm is the, the collection that just came out like two, three months ago. Great. That's why it looks so good. I bring there. greetings from the consort Shaira. She oh, okay. instructed me to schedule a session with you. I'm at the storage room, great. Time to hit the lock. Be careful, Brooks. So that was Shaira? Shaira was the consort from Mass Effect 1? Brooks. I didn't even know that. She was over there to mingle with. Hey, Commander. What? What happened? Infrared laser hooked up to a silent alarm. I didn't get it in time. Shepard, I'll call the responding guard to say it was a false alarm. But you must stall him before he reaches Brooks. Okay, stall the guard. Hey! Huh? Just calm down. I'm trying to do three different things here. Barrels? Sir, we checked out the alarm in storage. It's nothing. Minor accident. 
Find out who tripped it and get them in my office by end of Alright, it worked. Let's now you. What do you need? I'm sorry, are you with security? I thought you were a friend of mine. You've got the same suit. Nah. <laughs> you enjoy your evening. You're clear, Brooks. Thanks, Commander. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. Easy peasy. Mingle? Oh, more mingling? More mingling. Evening. What's popular today? Well, some adventurous souls are trying to mind fish. It's what Hanar like to do instead of alcohol. What? What's that? I guess since they're mostly water, the dehydration would be bad. Right. So there's this fish with hallucinogenic skin oil. Gets Hanar buzzed right up. <laughs> what happens if humans eat it? Way more potent. And it releases into our system slowly. Best to clear your schedule for the entire weekend. Oh yeah, sounds good. <laughs> sounds good. Uh, we're almost done with this part anyway. By the way, we're out of time for the night. I just wanted to see if I could finish this segment. It doesn't look like I'm going to be able to. Looks like it's going on forever and ever and ever. Commander Shepard, I thought I might find someone dangerous at this soiree. I'm Shaira. Yes, the famous Asari consort. I know who you are. She was in the first game. Yeah. No, you have heard of me. That is something entirely different. Point taken. Still mingling's not done. Ugh. Always been on black. Okay, so now I think you just need to get to me. I'm on the other side of the security gate. Right. Have you bypassed the camera back there? Well, I got my side. I you won. Still on, though. We need to finish this before someone comes by. Wait, Wait I lost? I'll get to you. What was that? It said I lost, but then I won. <laughs> it said you win, you lose. Have a little faith. I can distract him. Tell me when. Suspicious activity. My floor. Fuck. A guard spotted me. If you act normal, hopefully he'll move on. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. There's three guards in here. Interesting. You're not. That's what this guy's here that. for. I would apply they just to me six dollars says, hey Phil, what's up, Alfred? Thank you for the tip, man. Well, we did eventually get to the fifty dollar tip uh tip reward, thank gosh. Uh this casino here. I appreciate the, those who did contribute tonight. One of the slowest nights I've had in a very long time. Don't know why. If you will. Huh. Alright. Others who are not myself need it. So Alright, enough talking, this asshole. So it looks like, oh, I have to hack the camera first. So I have to hack the camera, then I have to distract that guy. Liara has to distract him. There you go. Those cufflinks, is that design inspired by late period Inusanan artwork? Here we go. The attention to detail is remarkable. Yep. Um, I guess. They were a gift. Are they valuable? Done. Okay. <laughs> what a pain. Gone. I'm not here to threaten you. We need to talk. He's dead. He's not moving. What the hell? I see this conversation will be strictly one-sided. Murdered. Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Damn it. Everything's been wiped. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... <gasps> when I tripped that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Thought so. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Oh, so we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Elijah, come crawling back. Guess again. Yeah. Killed. 
I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like a fish. You'll need to do better than that. The last guy that trash talked me was a few kilometers taller than you. Brave. I thought as much, but it won't matter. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. Why do this? What did I do to you? I'm gonna take everything you have and everything you are. Who is this guy? I don't remember this. Damn it. <sighs> Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the data drives. The ones that got wiped? You think we can find something? With Edie, anything's possible. The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. All right, we finished that part. Thank goodness. Civil Bubble, have a good night, man. Thanks for chilling with me today. Thank you, <clears throat> Shepard. That was fun. Well, not so much for the host. <laughs> you dead guy. Total loss. Brooks, work with Edie to see if there's anything useful on those drives. Here's hoping. I'll let you know what we find, Commander. Okay, well, ladies and gentlemen, I went to overtime here tonight. Let's save up. Next time around, we'll continue right from here. And what's funny about this DLC, okay, we've got this whole plot line of, you know, trying to murder the guy, assassinations. At first, it starts off like Fifth Element, then it turns into like a casino heist kind of a deal. After this, I believe there's one or two more things you do. And then after that, there's a whole epilogue that lasts like an hour or longer. And that epilogue allows you to talk with all the characters and have these personal dialogues and interactions with them that you never really got to have in the original Mass Effect trilogy. And that's really where the meat and, and quality of the DLC is. But we have to kind of get through this action-based story part first before we get to that. So, <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed it. That was fun. I'm looking forward to doing this again. Uh, it's going to be a while now. It's going to probably be until the weekend when I'm going to have a chance to play this again. Um, but we'll definitely wrap this up over the weekend. We'll get this done and then head into the end game of the game. So, good stuff. I hope you guys liked it. It was it was fun. Something very different, right? Very nice. <clears throat>